Hey y'all, I'm back again with another video. It has been many, uh, not many weeks, but it's been like a good three weeks since I've been on here and I apologize for my delay. Um, you know, just family stuff, life happening, but I am back with another video and I'm so happy to be back. Um, this video is going to be a Q&A part three. So um, let's jump right into it. Okay, so the first question I was asked was, what is your most asked question that you get? Um, it would probably be, are you single? I get that question a lot, a lot. Um, so yeah, that's my most asked question. Number two is places you like to travel. I love to travel. That is one thing that I just love. Um, I like in a general sense, I just love going to the beach. It is such a fun place to go. I am a Pisces, so I really enjoy the water and swimming and yeah, anything to do with water, I just love. It's my element. Um, number three, are you married? I'm not married at all. I am, yeah, I'm not married. <laughs> um, number four, do you exercise daily? That's a great question. I exercise um, five to six times a week. Um, and I know when I first started like really getting into working out, that seemed like so much. It was like, oh my gosh, five to six times a week. That's just, that like, who could keep up with that? You know what I mean? And the more that I've done it, it's been so, it's something I actually look forward to. It's not dreadful, you know, I actually like doing it. And so um, that's what makes it easier for me to do it five to six times a week. But you know, it's important to have rest days too. So I sometimes, you know, I go three to four times a week. It really just depends on my schedule. But um, for the most part, I would say five to six times a week. All right, number five, what is your favorite thing to bake? I love baking. Um, one thing that I tend to bake more would be brownies. My family loves my brownies and I enjoy making them. It's a lot of fun. I think baking is so much fun um, just because I love dessert. So <laughs> that's why I enjoy it. Um, number six, your favorite beverage. Well, right now, I mean, typically I try to drink just water, you know, because um, it keeps you hydrated and obviously it's good for you. But if I had to pick um, my top beverage, it'd probably be Diet Dr. Pepper. I think it's so good. Um, and of course I love Dr. Pepper as well, but I try to, you know, be as healthy as I can. <laughs> so yeah, Diet Dr. Pepper is really good. Comment down below what your favorite beverage is. Um, I, I typically, yeah, I try to go more for water, but I do love Diet Dr. Pepper. Um, number seven, what made you do fashion and do you feel you've made an impact on people's life? So what made me do fashion? Well, I, I mean, you know, the top thing would be, I just love fashion. I love clothes. I love putting outfits together. It's just so much fun what you can come up with. But, um, I would say overall, um, you know, fashion is just something that I've always enjoyed. And, um, when I first started Instagram, that was not what I was, you know, trying to do. I just kind of, you know, got into it and, just love the platform and fashion kind of, um, yeah, it came into my life and I just, yeah, went from there. But, um, do you feel you've made an impact on people's life? I would, I would say that's for y'all to, to answer. I'm so curious what you all have to say about that. Um, I always try to spread positivity, um, promote self love and just, you know, just spread love. And so, I really hope that I have made an impact on people's life. Um, I think that's just so important to, I try to inspire as many people as I can and it makes me feel good to do that. So yeah, I'm, I'm curious what you all have to say. Comment down below if I've impacted your life. <laughs> that would make me really happy if I have. Um, and the last question for this video is, how do you rise above negativity? I love this question because I think that there is so much negativity in the world and it's sad, you know, it's sad that it's like that. Um, I would say that, you know, the best thing to do is to, and, and of course, you know, this is easier said than done, but and, you know, it takes time to have this mentality or this mindset, but wake up every day, grateful to be alive, grateful to be here, you know, um, just 
you woke up another day. That's another day to get it right. Another day to, you know, it's a, another day to get it right. You know, you wake up and you have endless possibilities, you know, um, you create opportunities for yourself. And I just think that's pretty amazing. So wake up every day with a grateful heart and um, negativity won't get in your way. Just tell yourself, you know, today's another day. I'm going to, I'm going to make today a good day and I'm going to, I'm going to have a good day. And, um, you know, I, I, when I speak positivity, positive things always happen. So I feel like that's the best thing to do is just to speak positivity over your life. And that makes it easier to rise above the negativity. Um, but with that being said, I love you all so much. I'm so happy to be back. Um, and I will be posting lots more videos and yeah, just thank you for watching, supporting, subscribing, liking, commenting. <laughs> um, it's, it, I appreciate it so much and I love you all so much. <laughs> all right, y'all.